So today I'm going to make some sesame chicken. I already marinated the chicken last night, so I need to put some cornstarch and then fry it. So I'll show you guys how I make sesame chicken. So I'm just going to use some cornstarch. Let me pour it into my little plate here. It just has some soy sauce, salt and pepper and garlic and a little bit of cornstarch in here and I believe two egg whites so now I'm just gonna put everything into the cornstarch cover the chicken and once I have it like this I'm just gonna put it to the side off the excess this one. cover this one a little bit more so I finished putting cornstarch on all of the chicken now I'm gonna make the sauce next is soy sauce I'm using light soy sauce I have all of these ketchups I need to use, so let's use these up. Next, some sesame oil. Two. Some vinegar.
Okay guys, I got some packages. Let's open them. Got my teas. I'm obsessed with these teas and kombucha. Berry lemon. Peach flavors. I cannot drink my water without these anymore. They're just so addicting. My Nard shampoo. I lost one. These are just our wet wipes. I'm gonna have some of my peach kombucha. This one's a little sweet. This one's more bitter, the berries, but if you like a sweeter one, then get a peach one. It comes with these packets like this. And there are only, I believe, 15 calories. Hi. Hi, little boy. Hi. What do you want? You want to play? Yeah. You want to play? Play the box? Play the box? Oh. <laughs> Why are you behaving? Sit. Good. Good for the putty, for the multiple, for the bishan, for the bishan. Choo choo choo. Choo well. Choo choo choo. Mari just swallow. Mm -hmm. Baby butt. Queen B. Naughty girl. Can she cook? All done. Drink some water. Oi! Yummy home. Yummy home. Sit down. Oh, you cannot walk around. Sit down. Our Ellie is back home. We picked her up on Saturday. Today is Monday, so she's been home for a couple of days, but I'm keeping her in this little zipper crate. That way it's easy for me to open on the side and open on top to feed her. And then on this corner, I just put some pee pads and I'm letting her out like every hour or two to pee and I'm giving her water often. So she's pretty much going to be confined in this crate for about two months. She broke her bone and they had to put a pin in there. So if she moves around a lot and jumps, the pin can move and come out. So we have to be very careful and she's just going to be stuck in here. But 
this week we have to get another x-ray and then if it's okay she can get her stitches out and then after two months she's going to have to have another surgery to take out the pin in her leg and I'm just really worried I hope like the pin doesn't move because she is so hyper and crazy like I can't even touch her or hold her without her trying to jump and move her around so it's gonna be a tough two months but I hope she has a good recovery and no problems after one complication that can happen is that because she broke her bone in her growth plates her leg might be uneven so hey girls hey girls that's another problem if they play if they play she gets too excited okay come here if the other doggies play she gets too like jealous and excited and she's moving around so it's just going to be very hard to try to keep them all calm for two months but anyways as i was saying because um she broke her bone in her growth plate one of her legs could be shorter than the other so that might cause some problems in the future and she already has like grade two of the luxating patella so that's another problem that we're going to have to just wait and see but i guess we will deal with those when the time comes but for now oh she has to stay in here i'm letting her wear like the soft cone during the daytime so i can watch her and she's a little more relaxed maybe but at night time she wears like the hard plastic cone okay go back i'm sorry but yeah she's just gonna be in here it's gonna be hard too much you're gonna be so bored hmm? i know you want to come out i know but you cannot come out baby i know i know i'm sorry so we don't really know how she broke her leg i had her in another crate in the dog's room and I had fed her dinner and I guess I didn't close the crate like all the way and somehow she managed to escape and um, she was playing with them and she was free for about three or four hours and her and Jenny are on their periods so she has been like mounting Jenny and jumping like crazy for the past couple of weeks so I don't know what them two were doing but somehow she broke her leg and that's why we ended up in this situation, baby. Hmm? <laughs> okay guys, so I'm gonna open one of my packages. These days, I've been feeling like my life has a lot of bad luck. So I'm starting to buy some of these like lucky kind of items. So I ordered some lucky bamboo. Let's check it out. This is such a scam. Look how small these are. Can you guys see? They're so tiny. Another bamboo. It's very, very light. It's not that good. A little glass to go with it. Whoa. This 
but how to open it. This is a bigger, bigger one. And then it comes with rocks. And then I also ordered a paste cake for good luck. And it has this um other decor. Okay, let me put it together. Okay, so I'm going to put together these lucky bamboo. Need the rocks. Put some on the bottom first. And then these bunch. This is the bunch. Leave that thing inside there. Uh oh. I don't know if I was supposed to do that. <laughs> was I? Uh oh. I guess I was supposed to keep that on there. Probably not a good idea. Okay, I think I just messed that up. Oh my gosh, I'm stupid. Why did I do that? Okay, anyways, I'll fix that in a minute. <laughs> this feels like a lot of rock. Anyways, I need to fix this first. I'll be right back. Okay, I tried to fix it, but I don't know. I'm not sure. Next one. Ooh. Maybe I'm putting too much rocks. I'm supposed to use all of it, maybe. Okay. Feel so dumb. I don't know why. <laughs> Let me add some water. Okay. Why is this so hard? I'm struggling with this. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, it's a little ladybug. It's like a little sticker. Okay, so I filled these up with water. these up so now it's not like making a nice circle <laughs> oh. anyways that will have to be for now I guess there's too much rocks in this one I can't believe I cut that off. Oh, I was not thinking. Alright, I finally figured it out and fixed it. That was a lot of work. Alrighty, and then I have this 
little piggy. He's going to sit up here. And then this comes with some shells. I think I put too much water in here. Uh, oh no! Oh my god, you see guys, I have such bad luck. That is why I need this stuff. I don't know why I'm struggling today. I'm telling you guys, I have like bad luck all around me. Okay, Mr. Piggy. Maybe I need to glue him on there. I finally finished. Here is the lucky bamboo. Here's my little piggy. Three of them. I'm probably gonna try to find better ones and put them around the house. But for now, I have these and then I'm gonna wait for my other lucky items. Please, bring me luck. Anyway, they're not doing anything here. She not doing anything here. 